Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. What's happening guys? My name is Alex. My name is Alex and What's going on with the screen, dude? My name is Alex, and in this video, guys, I'm going to show you guys how to make the screen shake. I don't know what that what that was wrong. I'm going to show you guys how to make the screen shake, guys, in Sony Vegas. It's going to be really simple, really awesome, and I'm stoked to make this tutorial. Let's get started. Okay, guys, so now that we are on Sony Vegas, I'm going to drag in a little clip so I can show you guys um, what it's going to look like, and I'm going to use that as an example as well. So let me drag in a clip uh, real quick so I can... Uh, make that clip move you know with keyframes so I'm gonna do that with keyframes so you guys can do it along with me so let me drag in a little video 12 seconds later alright guys so as you guys can see I just dragged in a uh, no copyright sounds video and I'm just going to make it a little bit shorter it doesn't need to be that long so what we're going to do now uh, guys in order to make the shake is you just want to pick you know the clip they want that you want to have to shake then you just want to click on this little icon which says event pan crop this one boom and this is the window where you're going to make it move so in order to make this this move guys you're gonna use keyframes so at the bottom you see a little timeline what you want to do is you just want to start pressing on there then you just want to move it a, like a little bit and you just want to place a, a new keyframe place it another uh, direction place a new keyframe like just anytime just move it a little bit and then it's going that's going to make the shake movement so as you guys can see I'm just putting uh, the keyframes down and anytime you put a keyframe down a new one you just want, you want to put it a little bit you know uh, somewhere else so it's going to shake so I'm just gonna do it like real quick put keyframes down always it's like stop motion you know you pick like like one boom then you move it a little bit then a new keyframe move it again a little bit like that now I'm gonna make it like this boom and I'm going to continue doing this until it shakes so it, it is just a matter of keyframes so as you guys can see I have a lot of keyframes I'm gonna continue doing it for a little while now so I can actually show you guys how it shakes so anytime you put a keyframe down like I said just move it a little bit or you want them like turn it like how, however you want I'm just putting it random so I'm just gonna put keyframes down boom like this as you guys can see I have all the keyframes right there and I'm going to play back the video and let's see what it looks like As you guys can see, it's not really shaking. But so, what you want, how to fix that is you just want to move all the keyframes closer to each other. So I'm gonna place this keyframe right here. Then I'm going to put this one really close, really close. Let me do this for the entire timeline. So make sure those keyframes are really close to each other. So the movement is going to be faster and faster because the faster the keyframe is on each other, the faster it goes. How further a keyframe is one of, of one keyframe, how slower it's going to be. That's how it works. So I'm going to put the last keyframes right there. Three more keyframes to go. This guy, this guy, and the last one. Boom. Now they're really close on each other, as you can see. Let's see how it looks right now. As you guys can see, it's going really... Um, like it's going faster so if you want to like Alex I'm not going to pl uh, place 15,000 keyframes to make this shot you know shake really quick well what you what you can do is you can leave it like this you just want you can also X this out and what you can do is you can speed up this clip you just want to hold control you want to go stand on the edge and you want to drag it to the left so it's making so it's making it going go faster let's see how it looks when I make this a lot faster That looks a little bit better, guys. So let me make that as fast as possible in Sony Vegas. And let's see how it looks right now. That looks awesome, guys. As you guys can see, it's moving really quick right here, as you can see. And now the screen is shaking, and it's that simple. You just want to use keyframes. Like I said, you want to place them really uh, short on each other, as you guys can see at the bottom. And then you just want to continue. Continue place a little bit further new keyframe further further new keyframe until you are happy with the end result you can also speed it up and it's going to end up looking like this
So that's how simple it is guys, that's how you make a screen shake, you can do this with anything, it's just a matter of keyframes, place the keyframe down, make it a little bit further, keyframe, other position, keyframe, and so and you, then you just want to keep, keep doing that until you're happy with the end result. I would say this looks freaking amazing guys, as you guys can see it is shaking, and it's going really quick right here, and that's basically how to make a screen shake guys, it is that easy. I know I made like a tutorial about how to make a screen shake in the past, but this is just like a 2016 updated version, so I, I really hope this tutorial is helpful to you guys, and I would say that's the end of the video so that's how simple it is guys that is how you make the screen shake it is that easy just it's just you know a matter of placing keyframes and then just uh, drag the uh, screen to there then to there to there to there to there to there to there just make sure that you have uh, on random places so that's how you make you know the screen shake that's how simple it is thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video as much as I enjoyed to make this video so thanks again for liking and commenting on this video and I will see you guys tomorrow for two episodes of reacting to videos from subscribers as always on Thursday so I will see you guys tomorrow just Alex Halford yeah.